Now, Pyrenees from Casanova has stolen the hearts of those on Facebook. Thousands tracking his progress after his owner left him outside a dog shelter overnight. News Channel 9's Julia LeBlanc checks in with the Wanderers Rest Humane Association to see how far this young man Perry has come. If you look at Perry the Pyrenees now, despite being around 12 years old, you can see he's full of life. I cried the day he came in, and I want to cry just looking at him and how much he's improved, and it just, it, he melts my heart. Completely different from a month ago, when Perry's owner dropped him off at the shelter overnight, tying him to a sled, left with nothing but a bucket of water and this note, saying he's more than 10 years old and can't walk. He couldn't move. He was just sad. Those at the shelter took him in, posting on Facebook to send a message about abandonment. On top of his old age, they found Perry has Lyme disease and his fur was matted, making it hard for him to move. They never expected thousands of people would respond, now constantly looking for updates on Perry. We try to take action immediately um, where we can. Um, but our biggest point was to make sure people understand why it's not okay to do that and that there are, you know, resources out there to help them if they feel like they have to. Perry has been through physical therapy. He's gotten laser treatments and really has just gotten a whole lot of love since he got here three weeks ago. The community even stepping in and raising $6,000 for that treatment. Many thought he'd never walk again, and now they can't get him to sit down. His physical therapist becoming his foster parent. They've already bought so much stuff for him, he's going to be spoiled, so um, he definitely deserves that. A situation nobody asked for, but looking at him now, they're glad Perry is getting a second chance. Julia LeBlanc, News Channel 9. He looks much happier. Perry's owner, a 6-year-old man from Casanova, has now been charged with failure to provide care. And the investigation into this case is ongoing.